What is going on, guys? My name is Morgan, and welcome back to my channel where my uploads fluctuate as much as my, my anxiety. Long story short, um, I've just been having a lot of anxiety lately. Um, I don't want to get too into it because I don't want to start a big war um, because I know a lot of people get touchy about certain subjects. But hopefully in the next three-ish weeks, it'll be over with. If not, it's going to go on for the next four years, and I might not just be able to live through that. But in all seriousness, guys, read the shirt. Follow it. Seriously, please do, because I cannot take it our four years. It's bullshit. Anyways, we're going to go for another three episodes this time. Um, I'm surprised how many of you actually, like, watched the last reaction video. We're, like, at 8,000 right now, which is crazy, because usually when I start a series, it only gets, like, 1,000 at most. So I'm super appreciative of that. Also, you guys told me last time that you could hear, like, a buzzing in the background. I think it was my computer. Not entirely sure. Um, but I moved my computer farther away. It's, like, here instead of, like, here. So maybe it won't pick up. Hopefully it doesn't. If it does, I'm going to try and edit it out. I'll try my best. I don't know what the issue was. It could have been that I edited the audio so that YouTube wouldn't take it down. I don't know. Also, if you guys want to follow me on social media, get in touch with me, anything like that, all that will be down below in the description. So yeah, anyways, this one is called, I think, Intruder it was. Yes, Intruder. Uh, so let's get into it. And here we have the most fearsome creature king. in the world. The king of demons. The king. Placing his natural enemy, the ducky sock. <laughs> <laughs> I miss Where this precious you boy. Ducky sock? So you haven't learned anything about my kind. Prepare yourself. For Diamonds. Demons 101. Demons. Demon creatures of sulfur and bone. And cute little paws. <laughs> and cute little paws. And cute little paws. True. We live only Not in real life. chaos and misery. Our only weaknesses are a giraffe and passive aggressive comments sometimes. Oh, you guys are sensitive. Passive aggressive demons comments. Demons have inner demons. True. The most powerful demon of all is the Snaggleback. He is a bad boy. Never heard of that before. This is my paying attention face. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh oh, looks like it's gonna rain. <gasps> I love the rain. The first few drops in my hair. This probably won't go well, will it? Yep. Yeah, it's gonna kill you. Get back inside. Uh, oh, doors are for dead people. Go inside. Also, a lot of you guys told me to give Amity um, a chance. I didn't mean it like that. Like, obviously, I'm not judging her now because we literally just met her. And, like, her feelings last time were totally valid. Um, because, you know, she worked hard and with Willow, Willow, um, like cheated her away or whatever. So I get that. Um, um, so yeah, I'm, I'm not judging her based off of anything yet. Cause like I said, I just saw her for the first time. So she's probably going to change throughout the series. So that should be interesting on how that goes. The intruder. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot this whole town is on like a decaying body. Where's the conspiracy? <laughs> hmm. Look, now we're boo-boo buddies. Aww. Oh my gosh, I love you so much. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> yeah, we don't have weather. We have plagues, tornadoes, coronavirus, rainbows. <laughs> it's like a rainbow, but looking at it turns you inside out. <laughs> so, the, the rain doesn't get you. The snaggleback will. They wander the rains, feeding on boiled tourists. Well, whatever the case, this force field spell should protect the house from boiling rain. Someday I'd like to be as cool as Eda the Owl Lady. Magical, sassy, surprisingly foxy for her age. Nice. I think it's because she gets distracted by shiny objects. No, I don't. Smells <laughs> and shimmers and shines and delights. I must have it for my nest. <laughs> I want a nest. Uh oh, moving a little slow. Age finally catching up to you. Never comment on a woman's age, King. But don't you want to finish our lesson? I was gonna let you scratch a demon's tummy. Me! Oh, oh. Uh, sorry, King, but magic- Luz, how could you pass up on scratching the precious belly of King? But I wouldn't give to scratch that precious belly. I'm a sleepy little owl. I'm a sleepy little owl. Please, Ida, please. How am oh, I that freaking cow skull in the back looks awesome. Ida is me. Oh, sparkle thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <Yes. 
teach me? I respect your cunning, but I also hate you for it. <laughs> Where do you think magic comes from? Mm, from the heart? <laughs> Actually, you're right. <gasps> No, really. It comes from a sack of magic bile attached to a witch's heart. Oh. Gross. Can I keep that? <laughs> no. One more spell won't kill you. Uh, fine. Ooh, boy. Maybe it will kill her. Looks like one more spell killed Ida. Ah! Oh my gosh. My obsession with spells knocked out Ida. Does CPR I work on witches? Yep, she's out. Bat. <laughs> Just making sure. <laughs> we should boiling rains, remember? No, let her try. It'll be funny. <laughs> Woman could survive anything. She's probably just That's tired true. of staying up all night chasing shrews and bulls. Well, we can't just leave her on the floor. <laughs> like an owl. Oh my god, she has an actual nest. Oh. Come on, let's go downstairs. What's that vial? <laughs> Alexa, a day. King, those art skills are on point. It's really cryptish. Let me tell you about the most spooky chilling demon. Scoochie by the sweetie baby. <laughs> he's, he's a lot more threatening than his name implies. If I help you learn that spell, could we finish our lesson? Oh, yes, yes. You can teach me. King that is precious. Every day I notice Ida sneaking drinks of this special elixir. See? Then she always gets a boost hopefully. of energy. See? Oh, I was gonna say, oh, please sign alcohol. <laughs> and I know where to get some. Really? See? Thank Her bedside you. table. You're a prince. King. I'm king. Right. <laughs> yep, there it is. Now, where could it be? It's the only thing glowing in the room. <laughs> nice try. Nah, my heart wasn't in it. Elixir <laughs> a day. Cryptic. Okay, but why is the tag ripped? That's, that's... There's more to it, I feel. Did you check the back? Oh no, this is not gonna turn out well. All the lights are gone! This is awful! Who even needs a light spell when we have tons of lamps? Did you get any in your mouth? Um... Is that Ida? Oh, who'd he dead? Oh my gosh, the snaggleback! It feeds during the rains. It must have stumbled across our house and seen us inside. That looked an awful lot like Ida. The silhouette. This see? Is terrifying. This would be a great way for you to see a wild demon up close and personal. You want to go toward those creepy sounds? <laughs> see, uh, I would be out. Mm -mm. I don't do the spooky shit. Oh my gosh, Ida! She got yeah, she's gone. Oh, he's gonna get kidnapped, isn't he? Wait, or demon napped. The snaggleback got her! Be back by Boo Boo Buddy! Boo Boo Buddy! Oh, there's her shoe. It's gotta be Ida. Because it would be a huge. Oh, she's heading. It'd be a huge coincidence if it wasn't. For you to run. You're gonna hit loose. Snaggleback. Oh! Wow, you are a lot shorter in person. <laughs> what? A twist! A twist! <laughs> you ate him? Oh my. Oh, how's this gonna get solved? <laughs> that is terrifying. The curse at bay. <gasps> the curse. An elixir a day keeps the curse at bay. Curse? That's no snaggleback. That creature is. Either. Oh god, that's horrifying. Yeah. Looks like a freaking Wendigo. Oh god, no, 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 no. That is creepy looking. Holy. Mm. Flashlight out. <laughs> she looks like part bat, part owl, part one to go. So sorry, Luce. I I just want to 
wanted you to be into demons like you're into magic. Hmm. I don't have many friends, and no one even pays that much attention to me. I will pay attention to you all day, every day, King. Let's finish the lesson. <gasps> Shiny! <laughs> oh. There's a pattern in the spell circle. What? Where? I just did magic! Shh, we're not gonna stop anything with something that small. Do it bigger, do it bigger! What do we do next? This could be my new sleep paralysis demon. Oh, what lovely thing do we have here? It's just so dang shiny. Oh my. Dear. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing. Quickly. Yeah, I was like, close that damn thing. Well, that ought to do it. Yep, that did it. And my mouth tastes like roadkill. <laughs> oh, it's the freak it's a little demon, isn't it? Oh just I haven't been completely honest with you guys. When I was younger, uh, I was cursed. I don't know exactly how it happened. All I know is that if I don't take my elixir, well, that's why people call me the Owl Lady. No one likes having a curse, but yeah, if you take the right steps, it's manageable. Oh, so are you okay? There's I have something to say after that. About. Finally, I get to be a part of something! <laughs> You're a part of the house. All right, so the thing I wanted to say, what, what did Edith say? She said, I, hold on, I got I to gotta go back and listen to it real quick. Okay, so she said, <clears throat> no one likes having a curse, but if you take the right step, it's manageable. Now, this doesn't have anything to do with the sh Well, it's based off what she said, but it doesn't have anything to do directly with the show, what I'm about to say. Um, coming from someone that has a lot of mental health disorders um, and illnesses, I've heard that say something similar, um, say, something saying mental health is not your fault, but it is your responsibility. And that's kind of how uh, what Ida said reminded me of, because like she she can't control the fact that she got cursed, but she can control the steps into protecting others and herself by taking the elixir where it is like. Because I mostly hear it in true crime, in my true crime podcasts that I, that I listen to. And a lot of the people suffer from mental illness, which is why they do the stuff they do. And that's why they say, like, mental health isn't your fault. But it it's your responsibility to take the right steps um, to treat it or to get as much treatment for it as you can so you don't end up hurting yourself and others. So that really didn't have anything to do with the show. But I just wanted to point that out because I thought it was an important lesson that the Owl House taught. And, I mean, it connected with me because, you know, true crime, but uh, it really, it just connects to anyone that has a mental health issue or maybe a disability or whatever, you know. I'm not good with words, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, let's go on to the next episode. Oh boy. Okay, convention. I see, what's her face? Lumity? Lumini? Lumini? Uh, I forget what her name is. I'm sure. I'm sure I'll uh, remember it. Please stop reading that. It's flowery language is an insult to witches and driving away all our serious customers. <laughs> um, Ida? What customers? There aren't even a go. Absolutely not. <laughs> Since we were girls. We? I, I mean, who's we? You have a mysterious past. Now we gotta go. No. <laughs> Then you leave me no choice. You shall not shan't do it! No more harm! <laughs> Azura calleth out! So flowery, so awful. Most formidable. Hecate could only <laughs> screech it, did she? For the screeching did worsen it. <laughs> oh, show's so funny. So like I said, it's a job fair for witches and wizards, I'm guessing. Like, when I saw the word convention, I thought of, like, Comic-Con. But I'm guessing that's not what that is. It's a job fair. Alchemist <laughs> Anonymous tomorrow! Oh, that's funny. Artist Coven! I'm joining Artist Coven. 
Mixie Coven. Well, that oh, that's perfect for you to. Uh, excuse me, Mixie Coven. Oh, damn. Oh, you gave the wrong person the stamp. Oh, no, not this guy again. Creepy stalker. jumping on my lap and she slipped and dug her nails into my flesh. It proceeded to fall. Marcy, come here. You wanna sit? You wanna come up? Come here. Marcy. Hey, I'm sorry I yelled. Come here. Oh, you stubborn bitch. I need to rewind a couple seconds because I was too busy being in pain. Could be one of you. The crow lady? Is that Edith's friend or something? Yeah, there's some serious beef between those two. Oh, it's you. Willow's abomination thing. Hey, Amity. Amity! Funny story. That was an accident. Why are you being so mean, Amity? Because you and your pet are giving witches in training a bad name. I am not a pet! He's a very good boy, and <laughs> of demons. I challenge you to a witch's duel. Oh, Jesus. I accept. This is not gonna go well. One. If I win, you apologize to King for squashing his cup. Good night, sweet child. <laughs> and two, you admit that humans can be witches too. You have to stop training forever. Do it, Luce! For my honor! Fine, let's shake on it. The everlasting oath is sealed. That's probably fine. <coughs> I could win this, right? Oh, yeah, no. You got your cupcake anyway. Oh, God. Sister? That's your sister? Well, I have a student, and I bet she could wipe the floor with any of your prisoners. Oh, God. Bloods. Does it's she teach sad. Amity? Oh, it's <laughs> that would be so ironic. I need your help. I accidentally challenged Amity to a witch's duel, and I think she's going to kill me and <laughs> be dead. Hmm, it seems your student has met my sister. Oh, uh, yep, that's it. Come on, kid. Time to prepare for bloodshed. Who's what? Anyone's guess? <laughs> I'm coming at you with a blast of fire. What do you do? Water. <laughs> oh, that's right. I haven't taught you many spells, huh? The oh God. Proudly presents an impromptu Did anyone else get like mad anxious? We see I'm a little anxious. Year. I will know in my heart. Even if I win now, I lose. That's the spirit. <laughs> Show me what you got, human. I'm not gonna. <laughs> you better dodge. Dodge. Is her sister helping Amity cheat? Because she seemed like she was surprised at her own um power. magic? What are you getting at? Not dying. That's fair. Man, I feel bad for Amity. She's always getting cheated. No, 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 no. Amity, don't step any closer. Why, Luz? What happens if I step closer? <laughs> Spikes? I knew it! You were cheating! Amity, no! What happens now? It my idea to cheat, and when I found out, I tried to stop it, but... Who could believe anything you say? Yep. Construction coven. You cheated. Perfect Chrissy Lilla cheated. Hot dang, I love conventions. I only did that because I knew. Yeah, I I didn't think Amity would cheat. No. Amity, wait. Luz! Help me! Hey, wait for me! Don't play with 
my emotions. You were defeated. Don't get hated. Get your stank face treated. <laughs> and one more thing. How dare you? Oh, it's okay. I'm done. Because my rhymes are depleted. <laughs> They're gonna get that witch's duel after all, I guess. Amity, I'm sorry. <laughs> Seriously, just leave me alone. I didn't mean to embarrass you. That's all you ever do. First at school, and now this. Yeah, but... You made me look like a fool in front of the Emperor's Coven. My future! You think it's so easy to be a witch. I have been working my whole life to get to the top. You lost! You cheated! Say it! Say you're not a witch! I'm not a witch. But I'm training hard to be one. God damn it, I'm starting to ship! Oh my god! Look at me. Look at my face. The curse is worsening and I can't keep up with it. I don't know how much time I have left. So wait, is she it's nothing? A child could do a light spell. But I've never seen it cast like that. It doesn't come naturally to me like it does for you. So I've had to improvise. <sighs> The oath is unbound. Did it work? Can I still learn magic? Humans have no magical ability, but I doubt that'll stop you. Rose, you left me! Yeah, sorry. Your legs are just so tiny. <laughs> Should we get you more? But I have something for you, Luz. And it's the best thing because it's free, comes from my heart, and I always have more than I need. A hug? <gasps> is it love? Uh, no. Tote bags! And they have so many uses. <laughs> away, fair cherry. <laughs> away. Now let's go before my sister realizes I tied her pointy shoes together. That's <laughs> our cue. Sister? Now that's a mysterious past payoff. Oh, you think that's all the mystery I got? Wait till you hear about my parents. Oh God. You got parents? I need to know more. You very much don't. <laughs> I will capture her, ma'am. You have my word. Very good. Capture who? Edo? Are numbered, Edelin. Oh, yep. What does the Emperor want with her, though? I don't know. This, this is, this, there's a lot of, I feel like there's a lot of lore that is going along with this show. Okay, episode 6. Oh, God. I feel so bad for Amity! <laughs> I've never seen plane cars do that. Your curse is returning. Oh god. Did that battle with her sister have anything to do with the increasing? Or is it just like she said, like it gets worse? The longer it goes on? I don't know. Oh dang it. The curse of tiny legs. I know the pain. <laughs> Same. Those are demon hunters. Oh, protect king. I was up all night poison tasting, and for some reason, I don't feel great. Huh, I wonder I'm why. Juice, pal. Wait, what's wrong? Who hurt my babies? <laughs> Them. <laughs> Amity's having a moonlight conjuring and invited everyone but me. No, like me. Well, you're coming with me. I need an <laughs> extra pair of eyes looking out for pickpockets, and an extra pair of hands in case I want a pickpocket. Pickpocket! Then maybe they can come to the house. They say it was okay? Um, yes. She it's said It's not yes. gonna go well. We can do it at the Owl House. As long as we don't make a mess or touch anything and never bring up that we did it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Are you doing that thing where you hide in your hoodie? Meow, I'm not. Uh, oh, where's... <laughs> He's right here. <laughs> His little body just... Oh. He's weightless. Look at this. Really? I'm a sneaky sneakster. I've got lips in my pants. And I like it. Company! Hooray! Finally, someone to listen to my stories! Okay, one time, a sparrow blew Shut him up! Out, and then I... Hey! Well, 
Welcome to and then I got out. Living room. We say the incantation and make Guess reminds me a lot of Bo. Figurine. Moonlight I'm sure of. Moonlight take this chance. Moonlight tie this dream. And I don't know the words. <laughs> Oh boy, is it bad to do it in a magical house? Yep, it was bad to do it in a magical house. How do we do that? Willow Gus, hold here. Oh, you control it when you're all touching. We're controlling it with the power of friendship. <laughs> and the moon. Hey, you. You know where I can find a grim hammer? Not ominous at all. She noticed us. What do we do? Hmm. Hey. Rub it on her face. Hey, you. <laughs> but don't you see? I am no mere house. Before. I've got weaponry from the hinterlands, curses from the You look like Dobby. And jelly beans. Okay, never mind, you don't. Throw them over the cliff. No, this is not the Salem Witch Trials. We do not throw witches off the cliff into the water. Wait, 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 wait. Is this really what you want to be doing with your life? Tossing kids from cliffs? Actually, yes. It's been my dream since I was a boy. <laughs> oh, great. You're a fucking serial killer. You wanted to turn back, but I just had to show off to Amity. The truth is, she and I used to be friends. What? We played together as kids, but when she got her magical powers and I didn't, she stopped hanging out with me. Guys, is now the best time? Uh, I just wanted to prove to her that I was a powerful witch, too. Can't you do the you magical you vine shit? House to light. Amity to Fly yourself off with the vines! Step on him! Squish him like a bug! Oh, I don't mean to step on this victim. <laughs> <laughs> They're just children, Tom. <laughs> just because I have a model's body doesn't mean you can use it. <laughs> Nothing! Set the giant house to crow feet. Ida totally saw that. <laughs> wait, wait, was that my house? Ida, quick! <laughs> it's okay. I'm just glad I was included. Oh boy, you are so busted. And another thing, mm -hmm. that was totally amazing. And I'm so joining you for next <laughs> year's Conjuring. Now get to work. I can't believe they animated a whole house. Yeah, you're right. That takes some power. So what if we couldn't move a doll? Now we have time for what really matters. Pentagram! Where's Amity? <laughs> that was good. So that was episodes four through six of The Owl House. Um, I still love this show. This show is great. The The humor is perfect. Um, I can't remember the last time a show made me laugh this much. Other than, uh, did she even make me laugh this much? I don't know. But uh, yeah, um, I like that we're getting um, more background on the characters. Like Ida's sister and Ida's curse. And... We're getting to know Amity more, and we're getting to know Willow more. Like, the fact that she used to be friends with Amity. And, I mean, that that's it's so relatable, though, because, like, I had a friend like that. Like, we were really good friends. And, um, and then when we got to high school, she just kind of stopped talking to me. Like, I don't know why. I never really did anything. Actually, now that I think about it, I think she didn't, she couldn't deal with my depression. And that I didn't want to go out anymore or something. That I didn't want to, like, leave my house or whatever. She, I, that might have been a lie. How has it taken me this long to think of that? 
anyways, yep, yeah, um, that's, it's very relatable, um, I feel like a lot of people lose friendships, and they don't really know why, or they really can't control why they stopped being friends, uh, while I was at work, I was playing my For You, um, Made For You playlist on Spotify that comes out every week, and Little Miss Perfect, I, someone, I need to see who covered it, there was, I think it was a cover, it could have been the, I don't know, I don't know who originally sings this song, Right Out Loud, Jora, J-O-R-I-A-H, K-A, no, K-W-A-M-E, I don't, and then Taylor Louderman, that's the, if you want to look it up, that's the cover or whatever, but I, I was listening to it, and, like, <clears throat> I remember, like, you guys, I remember Amity was the one that was, like, singing it, um, from the song you guys had me listen to, and, like, I wasn't really paying that much attention to the lyrics themselves, but since I listened to it, like, a few times, um, while I was at work, um, like, the lyrics started sticking out to me, how, like, apparently she has to be the perfect girl and the perfect witch, and, like she said in episode five, I think it was episode five, um, like, she had to train her whole life to get to where she is, and that's probably why she takes it so seriously, because so much is expected out of her, because she's expected to be perfect, and that's a lot for anyone to handle. I don't know if, like, her parents, because I, I, in the song it said she got a, a, adopted, um, I don't know if her adoptive parents expect a lot out of her, like, if they're pushing for it, or if she just feels like she has to do it to prove herself. I'm not really sure. I don't know where I was going with that. My mind's all over the place. But yeah, I, I'm already, <laughs> I, I almost got teary-eyed when, uh, uh, Amity got embarrassed at the, uh, witch duel, witch off, something, whatever. Yeah, just, I think it's because I roughly know, like, her background because of that song. And, like, I already know, like, how much pressure she puts on herself and possibly other people put on her. Like I said, I don't know the dynamic between her and her adoptive parents or if there was a situation with her biological parents. Um... But then again, she said she was adopted when she was two, I think. Two or three. And um, so I don't think kids remember much before the age of three. So maybe she just, I don't, I don't know. I don't, maybe witches are different. I, I don't know. Human psychology might not apply to them. I don't know. And God knows I don't know much about human psychology. The only bit I know is what I get from my podcasts. So we're about a third of the way through the series so far. Um, season two's coming out next year, I believe. But yeah, I'm really glad you guys, um, suggested this show. So yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you have anything that I missed or want to tell me, feel free to hit me up on social media or leave it in the comments below. And hopefully I see you. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Peace.